So, I haven't touched this car in a while. I think I made a video on it on probably a year ago um, where I, you know, kind of suspected that I've got a bad, a bad head gasket. Um, and it's not because it's overheating or doing the typical rover stuff. It's more that uh, all the coolant is going away. I don't know where it's going. I think it's going to the engine. I think the last thing I did was I drove this, put about 150 miles on it after I bought it. I changed the oil. And then they all got milky. And I stopped driving it. <laughs> Alright, for no real reason, uh, let's go ahead and start it up. Oh boy. Oh boy. Alright, let's see if I remember what to do with this. And if I can put the camera somewhere. Hold on a second. sound very good at all, but it lives. Oh my god, I forgot what a turd this is. I don't think I've I don't think I've started this in six months. I wonder if it'll idle. I'm trying to get out of the truck so I can film it, but it keeps wanting to die. So let me let it warm up for a second. Ooh. What a beast. All right, it's idling. Typical exhaust leak. I can't remember if I put Oh, there's nothing in there. Absolutely nothing. I thought I just put some in. Oh, oh, there, there, there it is. It's uh, it's all in there. <laughs> Fuck. So, this is why I don't drive this that much anymore. Should probably turn it off. But yeah. There's the rover. Um, it's at the shop, obviously. Has to get looked at. Uh, figure out how bad that milkiness is. But uh, yeah, this is the one time I didn't get so lucky buying a Land Rover. So hey, sometimes you lose, but it's still a pretty sweet little truck. Um, it's been in this one spot for a very long time. And uh, it's also very broken, but it's, uh, it's a cool truck. <laughs> So yeah, again, another another quick little video, just a quick walk around. Um, oh yeah, one more thing. It also has the ear core disconnected, which is great, and wonderful. Nothing to worry about there. So thanks for watching. Check out the rest of my videos.